Welcome back to Q13 News. Huge announcement this morning from Kirkland-based airplane maker Zunum Aero. It says it has its first customer. It's going to be delivering a hundred of these right here. This is animation of its hybrid electric plane. Those planes going to be delivered to a private jet charter company, Jet Suite. This is a really, really big deal. It could be a game changer for how we travel for the airline industry in general. We know how important that industry is, aerospace in our part of the state. We are lucky this morning to be the only TV station in Seattle to have co-founder of the company, Matt Knapp, with us this morning. So y'all are going to be delivering your first real flying airplanes to a customer within like four years. That's obviously exciting for you, but what does it mean for me, for folks at home? Well, Travis, thanks very much for having me on. Uh, I think the best example here in the Northwest is just here to Portland. You know, that's a very heavily traveled corridor. You can get there on the bus, you can drive, you can go to SeaTac, take Horizon. No matter what, it takes you about four hours, door to door, at least four, four and a half, lots more if there's traffic. Yeah. Our airplanes, uh, they can fly nine people, smaller airports. You can fly out of uh, Bremerton, you can fly out of Renton, you can fly out of Payne. It's a little bit slower in the air, but you're going to be at your destination, and you're not going to go through TSA, you're not going to go through TTAC. You'll be there in about two hours. That's really what it means. It's taking that door-to-door -door time down by about half, and about the same cost you'd have paid on the airline or drive yourself. And doing it with a hybrid electric, which is hybrid just groundbreaking. <laughs> it's groundbreaking, and this puts us on the path to take aviation emissions down up to half over the coming decades. All right, so why is, I mean, electric such a big deal for, for, for passengers, but for the environment? I mean, there's so many reasons. There's couple really big game changers. One is you can make a small airplane that is efficient, uh, low emissions, and cost effective. And you can't do that right now. A jet's got to be big, it's got to go high, it's got to go fast. So that means you can't fly regionally cost effectively. That's the game changer with electrics. That's amazing. And, and the, the big guys are also big polluters. So what does this mean for the industry in general? Obviously, we're, we're aerospace born and bred in the Pacific Northwest. So we love that you're here. What could this mean for aerospace in general? Well, if you look at air travel, a lot of people say you can't reduce emissions, it's everybody flying long distance, but actually half the emissions are 1,500 miles or less. This is something hybrids can address in the next 15, 20, 25 years as batteries improve. So we're on a path to addressing half the emissions in the industry. That's amazing. That's, that's phenomenal. And it's happening in our backyard in Kirkland. It is. So Boeing, also a big backer. The state of Washington, a big backer. I mean, you're being taken very seriously. But I will say that when you first made this announcement and said the timeline was in a couple of years, there were a lot of people who just scoffed at you. There were certainly skeptics, and that's part of the fun of being on the leading edge. Um, but really, last year was the year that it tipped. It went from aviation, electric aviation is going to happen someday, to electric aviation is happening now. And we're really happy to be on the leading edge of that. Is it fair for me and for folks to compare you to Tesla? I mean, you're different, obviously, but the way that you could revolutionize the industry, the way that Tesla has really begun to revolutionize automobile industry. Well, we are not competing with the airlines, so there's a little bit of a difference. But we are extending air travel to be utility, utility down to 100 miles, 100 to 500 miles. That's where the airlines can't fly right now. So maybe not the best comparison with Tesla, but we are out there. We are revolutionary, and we are electric. I love it. I love it. Well, it's been fascinating to talk to you. We really appreciate your time this morning. Matt Knapp, the, one of the co-founder co of uh, Zunum Aero, and you are just going to continue growing and building aircraft and, and changing things as we speak in our own backyard. We are. Thank you. Thank you very much, Matt, for being here. Back to you.